now I'd like to introduce Ian Timmons to come up to speak. possibly learn anything. <laughs> it became apparent rather quickly that my arrogance was a fatal flaw in my character, to the point that it actually stunted my growth as me. Uh, how wrong was I? Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, I had always felt like a singularity within my organization, as many of you probably relate. It's like, you against the world sometimes, but it feels like it. Uh, out of the pool of potential, it's hard to find like-minded people sharing a similar plan. Growth is naturally stifled by isolation. I'm not a director, I'm not a manager, heck, I'm technically not even a supervisor, uh, but I'm someone that will make it work, I'm a problem solver. Uh, I strive for whatever I work on to be the best it can possibly be, and if it's not, I won't stop until it is. That being said, I consider myself something that I'm also working on. Uh, it turns out I fell short this time. I hold myself to an absurdly high standard. Uh, when we were forced to shred our cards, like I'm sure you guys remember, I could not, I would not shred my card. <laughs> it was integrity on that card. Uh, I believe the supreme quality for leadership is unquestionably integrity. It's because I do this to myself that I feel I also get better. Uh, the tools, understanding, and expertise offered here at this institution are essential for you to lead. Uh, the first day of class, uh, we wrote what we would like to improve on. Well, it turns out you don't really know until you know it's thrown in your face every Thursday for four months. That I so <laughs> the truth is, I was so far in aspects I didn't even realize. Um, my arrogance was simply a camouflage for insecurity. I'm sure I had always known this, but in my natural fashion, I buried those things. Um, I believe it manifested itself once I entered a room with such high caliber people like everyone here. Um, when I entered, I, I never felt so small in my life for the first time. Uh, I thought I was out of my league. What am I doing here? Uh, each person here was the best in their respective agencies. Just listening to each of you raise and answer questions through a picture in my mind, the similarities, the intent, it resonated. Uh, these aren't future leaders in the making, these are the leaders. Uh, they, like me, are building an arsenal of intellect that spans beyond simplistic work duties. They are adding to their influential prowess. You were selected for a reason, and your dedication to complete a program speaks volumes. It is my hope for you and your agencies to take these tools you harness and apply your cunning and intuition to prosper. You are leaders. May the fire of your leadership shape the future and foundations for years to come. Thank you so much for the opportunity to learn each and every single one of you. Uh, the intellectual uses the power of the brain. The wise uses all the brains available to them. Thank you. 